What's up mga kaboks? Bakit ayaw munang labanan ni Mikey Garcia si Manny Pacquiao? Pag-usapan po natin yan mga kaboks. Kamakailan nga lang ay usap-usapan ang isa sa pinagpipilian na susunod na makakalaban ni Manny Pacquiao ay itong si Mikey Garcia. Ngunit bakit parang biglang nagbago ang plano nitong si Garcia at bigla ding nagbago ang tono nito? Dahil matatandaan na kada tatanungin itong si Garcia ay walang ibang bukang bibig kundi ang pangalan ni Manny Pacquiao. You know, I'm gonna take on uh, big challenges. So if I can land something big, you know, big name, you know, possibly a Manny fight, you know. Ngunit, kailan lang po ay biglang nagsabi itong si Garcia na hindi niya muna daw lalabanan si Manny Pacquiao bagkos maghahanda muna daw ito sa isa niyang tune-up fight at bago harapin si Manny Pacquiao. We like to see you fight. We can't wait to see you back inside the ring. And we know that you're always about the big fights, about the legacy fights. You know, we've heard rumors about Manny Pacquiao. Is there anything that you'd like to share? Um, I, I am trying to get a, a fight before the end of the year. Um, it wouldn't be Manny yet. I know there's rumors out there, but that's not not accurate. Uh, um, I'm thinking, you know, I'll be fighting before the end of this year. And there, there's not a whole lot of details. I, I have nothing really secure. I'm trying to figure that out still. Um, you know, I, I could have taken on other fights, and I could still get an easier fight against a, a different level of opponent. Um, but I will be back. I will be back soon, and and then after this uh, fight, I want to push for something bigger. Like I said, uh, maybe the first part of next year will be will be one of those uh, big fights. So this whole, all the rumors about Manny Pacquiao, they're basically just rumors for now. Hopefully, it happens um, next year. Opinion ko lang mga kabox. Kung talagang gusto ni Mikey Garcia na makalaban si Manny Pacquiao, di ba dapat si Pacquiao na lang ang paghandaan niya at dapat nagawa rin siya ng paraan para matuloy ang kanilang laban? Sa pa po mga kaboks, paano pala kung matalo siya sa sinasabi niya tune up fight? Nakasi siguro kaya si Garcia na mananalo siya sa kanyang laban? At si Pacquiao na ang susunod niyang makakaharap? Ano po kaya ang tunay na dahilan mga kaboks? Pakinggan po natin ang opinion ni Johnny Boy hinggil po dito. See, this is why I show this ass Mikey Garcia. S clown Mikey Garcia. But uh Now Mikey Garcia. See, I should have expected this from Mikey Garcia. Mikey Garcia is singing a different tune about Manny Pacquiao. First he wants a tune up fight. Oh, now I get it, Mikey. You're pulling the same you did with Lomachenko because for those of you who don't know Mikey had two of the four belts we went, and then he pulled the same <laughs> man while they used to talk well I'm not waiting for Lomachenko I'm gonna move when I want to move I'm gonna move when I want to move now he wants a tune-up fight before Pacquiao oh. ang ibig pong sabihin ni Johnny Boy dito ay minsan nang muntik magcross ang landas ni Mike Garcia at ni Lomachenko Ngunit umiwas po ito kay Lomachenko. Umiiwas na rin kaya itong si Mikey Garcia kay Manny Pacquiao? At ano naman ang magiging batayan ni Mikey Garcia para iwasan si Manny Pacquiao? Pakinggan po natin ang opinion ni Showbiz Dadots. It's hogwash. So for me, I'm not going to believe that Mikey Garcia and Manny Pacquiao are really going to fight until the weigh-in. I do think that fight makes sense for Mikey Garcia, and here's why. I think Mikey Garcia, he must campaign at 147. Why? Because I don't think he can go anything lower than 140. And that if Mikey Garcia is going to stay at 147, he has to take on the smallest of the 147 fighters, and that's Manny Pacquiao. But between you and I, I think that's a bad matchup for Mikey Garcia. Mikey Garcia is an up and down type of fighter. He doesn't have too many special effects and it works for him because he's a great technical fighter. And he has decent punching power, but he has great footwork and he has accuracy. The problem is Manny Pacquiao is extremely unconventional and he punches like a big man. So I just think that's not a good matchup for Mikey Garcia. But if you're going to lose that welterweight Mikey Garcia, you might as well cash out. Tama nga naman kaya si Showbiz Dados sa opinion niyang yan. 
Pakinggan naman natin ang side ni Mikey Garcia tungkol kay Manny Pacquiao at sa huli nitong laban. Well, you were there for his last fight against um, Keith Thurman. Look, um, he looked great in his last fight. Uh, he came out and surprised everybody, including myself, um, first round and just came, you know, throwing punches and knocking uh, Keith down and just didn't stop. You know, that's something that we had not seen in Manny for several fights. It had been several years before, uh, since we had seen him like that. You know, so that's surprising. Mukhang hindi nga inaasahan ni Garcia ang performance ni Manny Pacquiao sa laban niya kay Keith Thurman. Marahil ang ini-expect ni Garcia ay ang kupas na at wala nang lakas na Manny Pacquiao na haharap kay Thurman. Kabaliktaran naman ang kanyang performance na kanyang pinakita sa huling laban niya kay Errol Spence. March 16 itong taon ay naglaban itong si Errol Spence Jr. at si Mikey Garcia. At natalo nga itong si Mikey Garcia by unanimous decision ni Errol Spence Jr. At nung isang linggo lang ay nakalaban naman ni Errol Spence si Sean Porter at pinahirapan siya nito. Matatandaang tinalo naman ni Keith Thurman itong si Sean Porter by a unanimous decision. At si Keith Thurman naman ay tinalo ng ating pambansang kamao na si Manny Pacquiao. Ano sa palagay niyo mga kaboks? Dapat nga bang matakot na itong si Mikey Garcia at wag nang labanan ang ating pambansang kamao na si Manny Pacquiao? Comment down lang your opinion mga kaboks. Maraming salamat nga po pala sa mga nagsubscribe sa ating channel. Hanggang dito na lang muli mga kaboks. Marami pong salamat. At sa mga bago pa lang, please huwag niyo pong kalimutan na mag-subscribe. I-hit niyo po yung notification bell para updated po kayo sa mga bagong video. Muli, maraming salamat po mga kaboks.